And welcome back, folks. Now, the Bevel Cloister of tri uh, Trials is... Quite honestly... Well done. Let me just double check that. Now, the Bavel Cloister of Trials, folks, is one of my absolute least favourites in the game. Now, I think it's probably... Ugh. <clears throat> so, I'm drinking Coca-Cola as I speak today. It's a very technological one to begin with. Now, can you... I've got to get my, my wits back here. Ah, now that's it, look. Got a clue here, folks. Aha. Okay, we shall definitely take the Bevel Sphere. So even after all that blooming stupidness about technology, even Bevel... Oh, what fuzzing feedback! Even Bevel, which is supposed to be kind of the capital of the Yevonites, um, even they are using technolog technology, even. In the heart of their... Temple, religion, whatever you want to call it. Now, please let this be right. Probably won't. Nope, it's not right. Ah, never mind. I can carry that one. Okay. The only thing to actually say about this whole area is I'm not too fussed, if I'm honest, about not getting the Destruction Sphere treasure type thing. Only because the item that you get from the Destruction Sphere isn't that great here. Coca-Cola. So that's completed one path for me. Should bring us back to the start, I would think. Yep, let's reset it. So I want to be going down this bit on the right. And I would think...
I would think it's that way. Right then, let's put a thingy what's it in that one. Now, can we walk across? Ah, we can walk across there. Right. Okay, so that doesn't actually do anything. Okay. Let's go for a ride again. Because we still haven't found that area. Where that... Um, where that kind of platform was created for us. gone the wrong way here. Yep. <clears throat> Again, I just cannot think how as a kid I worked this out. I must have done it though. No way, didn't I go in? Yeah, I've been there before. I reckon it's this middle one. Oh wait, could that be right? Could it? So that's not the right way. Unless... Definitely not it. I can see that now. Hmm. Okay. Gotta be this one then. It's gotta be. Ah, now. If I, t I can see what that's gonna do already. No, maybe not. I thought it was gonna depower that thing. 
Okay, okay. Nothing will have changed there, will it? get there as I always say. I don't know what going back up top will do, but... Didn't want to land on that one, thank you. Now, was this one of the ones that I picked up at the start? Ah, now hold on a minute, I've just thought. I have a feeling, now that I think about it... I think that Glyph Sphere... Because it's different to a Bevel Sphere... I have an idea... Was it this one? I don't think it was, actually. I want that one. Come on. Get it right. Ah, good, it was that one. Right, well, I'm going to try the Glyph Sphere in that area over there, because I have a feeling that could be it. It's my own fault, really. I wasn't watching. I mean, a Glyph Sphere is different to a Bevel Sphere. Aha! Yeah, cool. We've got a Destruction Sphere now. I don't know where to use the Destruction Sphere, but I'm sure we'll find out. Risk taking that. Hmm. That won't do anything. So that first one is a wrong way to go. That second one is the wrong way to... No. 
That second one could be the... Oh, I'm so confused. No, that can't be right, because if I put that in there... Hmm. Alright, not quite sure there. go let's go down for now I see I do hate these cloister of trials. I really do. I just bit my tongue. Ow. Well, that one on the right has got to be right. So now, I suppose, the only thing to do is to find exactly where the Destruction Sphere goes. Hmm. I have a feeling this is probably going to be wrong, but I'm pretty sure I'm going to have to look at a guide for this. As I've had to do with most of the cloisters, well, the last three at least. Okay, that did bloody nothing. So we know it's not to be used in there. It's neither... Hold on. So where could it be? I know where it could be used down here. It could be used... I think it's that second one. That's not where we got it from, I don't think. Oh, nice. Hmm, that didn't do anything, though. Hmm. I 
can we actually get access to that one? I'm also thinking I might go back up to the top level just to get that other Bevel Sphere. I just have a feeling I might need it. I think it was that one on the left. I like what they try to do with these real puzzle solving ones, but to me they just slow the game down. So I have to go down this one. And then... Right, it's this bit that I want to get confused at. Now, is it this one on the right? Could be wrong, but I think it is. You watch, I'm going to be wrong now. Just watch. I know, that's kind of right. Ah! Hello to a secret exit. Sphere. And how do we get that up there, though? Can we just push it? Hmm. Ah, that's how. Now, if I'm right, that is going to be the Night Lance. Ooh, that fuzzing feedback. It's really misbehaving today. I apologise for that. Boom. Now, I'll show you that in a minute. It's from what I remember. Let's see if I'm right. Yeah, I was going to say, I thought it was almost like fully strength uh, powered up. It's not bad if you're using Kamari. I don't, though. Yoda? <coughs> Inside, maybe? Then what are we standing here for? Good luck moving that, my friend. Hey! You can stuff your taboos! Good on you, Kimari. Yeah, you 
Now look at that guy, folks. What's that? A faith. They join with the summoner, and together receive the Aeon. Their human souls, imprisoned in stone by ancient Yevon rites. The dead should be allowed to rest. Now, just for the record, Bevel's Aeon, fuzzing awesome. I mean, in this whole playthrough, you really haven't seen many of the GF, uh, many of the Aeons being used. That's because, like I do in most of the Final Fantasy games, I tend to rely on, well, my raw party. Uh-oh. There's the last of them. You are to stand trial. <laughs> I expect it will be a fair trial. <laughs> of course it will. Kinnock. We could easily fight these idiots off. Oh yes, folks, we have got Bahamut. Oh yes, otherwise known as Bahamut. I don't like it when they call it Bahamut. I've never liked that. Uh, I will save, actually, yeah. I can't believe I'm like 42 hours in. I know that's not the whole length of the Let's Play, but even so. The High Court of Yevon is now in session. The sacred officers of this court seek nothing but absolute truth in Yevon's name. Pfft, <laughs> Yevon. To those on trial, believe in Yevon and speak only the truth. Maester Kelk Ronso. Summoner Yuna. You have sworn to protect the people of Yevon, true? Yes. Then consider. You have inflicted dire injury upon Maester Seymour Guado. Conspired with the Albed and joined in their insurrection. These are traitorous and unforgivable crimes that disturb the order of Yevon. Objection! Idiot! Tell this court what possessed you to participate in such violence. Your Grace. The real traitor is Maester Seymour. He killed his father Jiskel with his own hands. What is this? What is this? Hmm? Seems How Kelk is Barry in disguise. Not only that... Maester Seymour... is already dead. It is a summoner's sacred duty to send the souls of the departed to the Far Plain. Yuna was only doing her job as a summoner. Grand Maester Micah... Please, send Seymour now! Send the unsent to where they belong? Yes. Yes! <laughs> Maester? Send the dead? Hmm? Uh. What the fuzz? You would have to send me, too. What? 
Grand Maester Micah is a wise leader. Even in death, he's invaluable to Spira. Enlightened rule by the dead is preferable to the misguided failures of the living. 